Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. Before we start please, like this video, and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, and click the bell icon, thanks. Kit Hesketh Harpy, the British musician, composer and screenwriter, has died suddenly aged 65, the independent has learned. The multi-talented entertainer, who performed for King Charles, enjoyed a prolific career that included writing the screenplay for director James Ivory's 1987 film Morris, starring a young Hugh Grant in one of his first on-screen roles. He was the brother of Sarah Sands, journalist and former editor of The Evening Standard. His death comes as a double blow to the family, amid an ongoing search for Miss Sands, former husband, British actor Julian Sands, who went missing two weeks ago while hiking in Southern California. Miss Sands spoke of the shock over her brother's death. She told The Independent, Kit was dazzling, clever, original, funny, kind. The last time I saw him, he was busy mapping out pilgrim routes across Norfolk. There was always the next adventure, the next joke. He gave and gave and gave. Known for his work on shows including The Vicar of Dibley, Hesketh Harvey was married to the actor Katie Rabbit, an original member of dance troupe, hot gossip, and former girlfriend of Prince Andrew until the former couple's recent, difficult divorce. Born into a foreign office family in Malawi, Hesketh Harvey was educated as a senior chorister at Canterbury Cathedral, then at Tunbridge School in Kent. He studied English literature while on a choral scholarship at Clare College, Cambridge, where he was also a member of the Footlights Drama Club. He was passionate about opera and classical music, once writing for The Guardian in 2010 about how he had brought the last days of Monteverdi, considered the father of modern opera, to life with his production, Monteverdi's Flying Circus. His translation of Fran's letters, The Merry Widow, was transferred from Leeds-based company Opera North to the Sydney Opera House in 2011. Also speaking of the late star, the Daily Mail's travel editor Mark Palmer, who was his brother-in-law, added, he was the most brilliant, witty, gentle, and talented man I have ever known, deeply loved by everyone, including King Charles, for whom he used to perform. So what do you think about this news, guys? Please, share your personal opinion with us in the comments section below. Thank you.